What's up y'all, it's Woof Woof Wolf. Today I'm going to be playing the best reviewed Star Wars game on Steam, Star Wars Empire at War. Check out this game's extremely positive reviews. So, um, it's a game, it's a good game, the mods are pretty good too, thank you for coming to my TED talk. Today we're playing with the Empire at War remake mod by Emperor Nico and the Dutchman, as well as the Clone Wars 4.0 by Ozzy667. Alright, so the first skirmish we're going to be playing is the Battle of Coruscant. This is exactly like the opening to Revenge of the Sith. Just look at how beautiful this is. I just love having uh, Coruscant in the background. It's just so beautiful. Oh, is that the, uh, that's the, what is this, secular class. I don't know what it is with the Republic and the Empire, but they just love giant triangles. We got a Lucre Hulk over here that's fighting the around three to four Venators. Oh my god, look at all those falling Venators. Oh, this one's about to go down too. I'm sorry, man. Wow, look at those turbo lasers firing. That's so cool. And now a quick message from our sponsor. Would you like to learn more about one of the easiest ways I've ever seen to earn money? The coolest part is you can literally do this anywhere. While watching Netflix, eating pizza, or even passing time with your friends. This is a survey website called Opinion Outpost. I've tried it out and it's extremely simple to use. Opinion Outpost pays out $390,000 each month to survey takers. So click the link in the description below and join over 2 million people to earn easy money. Thank you to Opinion Outpost for sponsoring. And now back to the video. Oh my god. You guys know what that ship is. Oh my god, it's using the ion cannon. Guys, it's using the ion cannon. Brace yourselves. Oh, it just fired. It just fired. Whoa, what is this? Oh my god. It's the executor. Look at this thing. Look at this thing. Oh my god. Yeah, we're 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 gonna die. <laughs> you can already see the ship going sideways. Whoa, look at this POV. Oh, they just blew up. What is this? What are these things? Pokeballs? Alright, I, I, I don't even want to play this. I don't know what this is. Whoa, look at the Mon Cala ships too. Oh my god, look at the hangar. You can even look inside the hangar. This is huge. Oh, I love the look of this. Massive ships really turn me on. Oh, ho, 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 look at those engines! Bro, pull up with a whip that has two, four, six, eight, ten engines. So, the space combat in this game is extremely uh, simple. You can build resources, uh, resource mining facilities, which affects how many ships you can build and how fast you can upgrade your base, which will allow you to build more intricate ships. Oh, we got X-Wings moving in. Oh, look at those X-Wings, trying to bombard Admiral Piet's Star Destroyer. Denied. Oh, he just got blown to smithereens. This looks kind of like Scarif, actually. Oh my god, we can build Thrawn. This might crash my game, actually. Of course. No, it didn't. Admiral Thrawn has joined the fray. But yeah, I love the space combat in this game. It, it's just so immersive and so exciting. Especially when you get to, like, dominate, you know, the battlefield like this. It's really fun. Alright, guys, this is a victory. Woo! Let's do a let's do a land battle. All right, all right. We're on Felucia. As you can see, we have a battalion of clone yes, troopers sir. already. We can build bark speeders. Let's build some scouts. We can build Captain Rex. We can build Obi Wan. Let's build Obi Wan. Requesting. Ah, we can build an LAT and an ATT. Production. Got another mission, sir. Yeah, I got another. I got another mission for you guys. Come over here and build this resource point. Oh wow, we already we already have enemies. Come on, troopers, fight them off. Blast those clankas. Oh, they're inside our base. Let's go, troops. Go, 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 go. <laughs> look at the look at the troops that are T-posing. Let us bring in construction. An ATTE. Let's bring in Obi-Wan. Let's bring in some bark speeders. And let's bring in another battalion of troops. Oh yeah. We got Commander Cody, I think. Oh, we got we got a com we got a combat situation over here. We got a combat situation. Come on, Kenobi. So the cool thing is you can put the clones inside the, the gunship. And then now the gunship has all the clones. And you can move it. You heard the man. But yeah, you can see like the gunship can attack and everything. You can also put them inside the, the tank as well. You may also load people into the turbo tank. Oh look, Anakin and Ahsoka come out of the twilight. Let's get Mace Windu over here too. Oh, he comes in his starfighter, of course. Oh, he comes with pawns! Uh, this is Blitz. This is Fives. This is Echo. 
Who the f***? Oh, ho, ho, look at our whole army just marching into battle. We got clones, we got tanks, walkers, we got an ATTE and a juggernaut, which is inside of the ATTE. Empire at War came out in February of 2006. I'm very impressed that it has continued to stay relevant and enjoyable until today. Not mad that it's the highest rated Star Wars game on the Steam Store. Enemy space station has been upgraded. Off. Oh, oh shit! You're not on the C900 year fiend, broken data bar green! What the hell is an aluminum falcon?